Some people complain that in Britain we're so standoffish and or repressed that we can't even talk to each other on public transport. I think that's a wonderful thing. I sit on a full bus or underground carriage of people sitting together in complete silence and my heart swells with pride at a culture sophisticated enough to have evolved a convention that acknowledges that chatting with strangers is almost always an unrewarding chore. What a hell we would make of our lives if, on top of having to go to work every day, get stuff done and hold down a job, we also had to worry about making conversation on the way there and back. If only we could expand this enlightened attitude to social occasions. Why, at parties or dinners, are you never allowed to sit with your friends? These are the people I know I like. I've invested time and energy into finding people whose company I enjoy and who are able to tolerate mine. But dinner parties in particular seem to be designed entirely around the thought, which people who haven't met each other can we make meet each other? So people who already have friends are set up on awkward dinner-length mini friendship dates with potential new friends. Why do we do that? It's not as if we set up people who are already married on dates with potential new spouses, even though I bet that would be a hell of a lot more popular.